Go figure. I went to go take a video and didn't delete the last set of videos on my phone. So five minutes in, it killed off on me again. So fantastic. Hey there, everybody. It's me again. Uh, I'm just basically doing a little update video. I was just saying that I had a visitor today, uh, Tweedlebop, fantastic illustrator, a little fun visit, old friend I've known since junior high. And it's when people come by and they take a look at uh, the layout and they haven't seen it before, they haven't seen it in a while, and they're just like, oh, look at that. Oh, check this out. Oh, I could spend hours looking at this. That's really nice. It's fun. Um, it's a fun little uh, exercise. Um, so, yeah, just a few little update things. I, I, I pulled this guy out of mothballs. Um, I have a, a system where I basically put items on this, this dead track here that goes around uh, to, for storage and then you know move it to the other track when I want to run it. And I've been running this Modemo for a while. This yellow guy here runs really well. I'm really happy with it. And then, you know, which is different than this other Modemo, this guy, this red guy that does not run very well at all. And it's just like, oh, well, this is a different type of drive, I guess. But this one, I love these. I, 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 I love how it moves and it's very smooth and very cool. And this Kata one, uh, that usually is very good. I just it does not run as well, and I'm sure it's it's the power that I have, the power setup. Um, I think it's just not not good, and I need to get somebody over here to help me with it because I'm not a power guy at all. I don't know anything about electricity, and it just makes me crazy. So uh, so that's a thing. Um, I've been playing around. I've been I got some more Green Max kits, um, and I just really like how how all these different kits go together. Again, this is one of the questions that, that Tweedlebop had today, um, where it's just like, what kind of kits do you get? And I'm like, I get all sorts of kits. I get these Green Max guys, like this guy, and what else is a Green Max kit? Oh, this guy's a Green Max here, um, which I love. Green Max kits are very, they're very plain. Uh, they come in gray, and you paint them up yourself. Uh, it's, you know, it's a model kit, which is great. I love it. Um, and then you get stuff like Tomy Tech, which basically comes in the box all weathered and ready to go. So you just build it. So that's another style. You get the Kato stuff, which I've been weathering. Um, basically comes in a box already built. You don't even have to put it together. You know, even the, the, um, the Tomy Tech stuff, you have to actually put together. Uh, the Kato stuff, it just basically comes in a box. You, your you know, idea is you take it out of the box and boom, put it on your layout and you're done. Uh, I've been going through and weathering and, and things like that. And then you get the Sen Senkai paper kits as well uh, with the dimensional printing of the roof and the like. And so you get a nice feel with all these different buildings, especially if they're all the same style. They all play really well together. It's like uh, Kato, Ka uh, Tomitech, uh, Tomitech, Tomitech, Senkai, um, Green Max? Not sure. Tomitek, maybe. Uh, Tomitek, Senkei, Green Max. So this is, it, it's a very good blend. You can see it back here as well. Uh, Senkei Paper Kit, uh, Tomitek, Kato. So it all plays very well together, and I like mixing it up like that. Uh, it's been working out really well for me, so that's great. Um, what else? I've been playing around with these... Um, Green Max stations. Ooh. A little tram station. You can see it's a little uh, smaller, a little lower profile than the uh, tram station over here. And it's just something that bugs me. Like I noticed, I took BART today, and you can see that here, let me see if I can point to it. Oop, there we are. Uh, the doors are below, well below the station here. And it works well for the Kato, the standard train stuff over here. Um, that's a little bit larger profile. But for the trams, it doesn't really work well. So I've been playing around with these tram stations. Uh, I'm going to go duck under. Whoa! 
and they they work nicely for the trams but then you have to figure out the height that's an interesting thing the height is being interesting here the height here um whoop, there we go i forgot i'm zoomed in here this is another green max station that i'm playing with tonight and the height the track height is interesting it's like this is basically the track height so then if you put it on this is a standard you know foam core foam board um, then it comes up to the right height for the tram. So you want the, you know, um, with this, as it's flush, um, it's, it's a little more forgiving. I have this on a little, this little bump guy here, but for the other items, when it's right off of the, the Cotto track, you need a little bump up. So I got to build this up tonight. Oh, there we go. Um, so it's going to be bumped up and then going to have a ramp coming down. Um, but it plays nicely with the with the modemo and the the other trams because they're just too they're just too high if you don't have that so that's good and the last thing I'd, i'll say is this the i'm really enjoying the the sidewalks here in uh, shizuka uh sidewalks really make it um you don't have buildings just with like the severe drop off like you know the kato buildings here that i have to address and so it's nice. It's nice to have that and have the people walking and I'm getting kind of the stuff that I want, you know, more people, more cars. Uh, I want to get more trucks, um, you know, and more buses. I, of course, can't have ever, you know, ever have too many buses. So, yeah, I'm just kind of having fun and keep doing stuff. Um, here's a little Senkei action here. I think I showed that one already. Guy on there. Um, another thing I want to kind of go back in and address this, this section, this section is kind of, hasn't gotten a lot of love lately. It's gotten a lot of photos, but it hasn't gotten a lot of like updates. So I'm going to play around with that and, uh, just enjoying my layout and really feeling like, wow, I'm, I'm a, I feel like a lucky guy to have this space to play in. So it's, um, it's been very nice and it's a very fantastic way to relax from a long work day is to play with trains. So thanks a lot for watching and I'll talk to you soon.